Kasuna State Governor Diko Rada has asked for the assistance of the Nigerian military to tackle banditry and cattle rustling in the state. The state recently inaugurated a community watch group to improve intelligence gathering. There is more in this report. Katsina, just like many states in northwest Nigeria, grapples with activities of bandits. Its proximity to neighboring Niger Republic, coupled with the porous borders, heightens the state's security challenges. The state recently inaugurated a community watch vanguard to gather intelligence that will enable security forces combat insecurity in the state. The last administration, what they did was uh, they negotiated with the bandit, and the negotiation has not yielded any result. We felt that we have to use kinetic and non-kinetic approach to address the issue. The visit of the governor to defense headquarters is to seek more assistance. In a country that is independent. The community watch vanguard will be working with security forces to scale up operations. We have to come to you. We don't have any other place to go to, to salvage our situation. As we are aware, there is an operation under Indaji going on in the state by the army, and I think it is not be out of context if we request for the expansion of the Operation Hader and Daji. We are going to talk to people for them to cooperate with the troops. It's not when you see something, don't keep quiet. Be able to do that. And then if you are able to get uh, calling numbers, that people when they see something, because sometimes they get scared, who do they talk to? So they must have those avenues, uh, we have told sure. commanders to wear, so that they can report. When they see something, they can report. And what they like is when they report, let them see action. action they take. Yes, that encourages them to want to do more. 19 local councils of Katsina State are most affected by bandit activities and the number of victims continues to increase. Sifon ACN TVC News, Abuja.